Retrofit Qi charging to your Apple AirPods? That's just what this does. Let's check it out. Dave Taylor here and I'm looking at this. This interesting little device is the Hyperjuice wireless charger adapter for AirPods. And what it does is it adds something that Apple should have added a long time ago but hasn't, which is Qi charging to the Apple AirPods. So here are Apple AirPods and it's a lovely tiny little case and of course the AirPods are inside and everything. Really beautiful design, typical Apple, but you gotta plug it in on the bottom and that's kind of clumsy. So enter Hyperjuice with this little cup, right? What it does is you slip your iPod, sorry, your AirPods into it, push it down so it's secure. Now I will note, you can still access it. There is nothing here that hinders use of the device, but when you put it on a Qi charger, as I happen to have here, it actually is charging. You can see there's a tiny green light there. So now my AirPods are charging automatically and wirelessly. Apple, hello, tap, tap, tap. Why the heck doesn't the AirPod already include this feature? Seriously, but whatever. Hyperjuice comes through again with a really nice solution. Now, let me tell you, these are white polycarbonate, so they're exactly the same material, finish, and color as the Apple AirPods. And they definitely add a little bit of size to it, but it's really fairly negligible. Negligible, <laughs> that's a tricky word. You try saying that. And it really adds almost zero weight. It's an extremely light little device. It's, kind of amazing that it works actually. It's such a small and simple little device, but it does work. It works with five watt Qi chargers and it will give you a 1.5 hour full zero to 100 percent charge of the AirPods, including if the actual buds themselves are dead. So, okay, that's what the vendor says, but I test things. So, I actually found through testing that it gives a 68% charge in one hour, which means that one and a half hours is about right. It's actually almost exactly right on 90 minutes for a full charge. And the nice thing is, is that this makes this work even if you are, say, stuck at a coffee shop that has built-in Qi chargers in the tables. I don't see that very often, but sometimes, like San Francisco has a bunch of those. And so you can slip this in its little pod and a little case and you are charging while you're having a conversation. Super nice. The LED indicator obviously is a big win because otherwise you wouldn't know whether it was working. Super nice. And this, by the way, this is the Fuse Chicken Gravity um, Gravity Touch, that's what this one's called. And it's a very nice Qi charger, reviewed it separately. But just in case you're wondering what this bamboo Qi charger is, now you know. But this video is all about this little Hyperjuice wireless charger. So, only thing left for me to tell you is the price. But whoa, before we get to the price, go ahead and click on subscribe and give me feedback. Do you have AirPods? Probably. How do you charge them? Do you just plug them in? Are you annoyed? Is that frustrating that everything's moving to fancy wireless charging except the AirPods? Apple, th you know, theoretically has something in the wings, but so far we've seen nothing, nothing, nothing. So who knows when that will come out? In the meantime, Hyperjuice has you covered. So this <clears throat> interesting little device is the Hyperjuice wireless charger adapter for AirPods, and it is $49.99 at hypershop.com. So this is not an impulse purchase. It's pretty expensive, a third of the price of the AirPods, but you know what? It's a really nice added function. And I have to say, it would be mighty easy to just always have your AirPods like this and just have it permanently in the little carrier. And anytime you're near a Qi charger, boom, you're charging. How cool is that? So this is Dave Taylor. I'm telling you, if you have AirPods, you should check this out and I'll catch you in my next video.